What's going on, Helldivers? My name is Gun, and it looks like we got new leaks from Patriotic Grim Reaper. That being of the new Warbond coming out in July. So it should be the second week of July. So it should be the second Thursday of July, that being the 11th. I don't think this will be released in July. Probably more of a timeline like August or September, because I think this one might be a free Warbond as well. This also looks like it'll, it'll be the first crossover for Helldivers and a lot of people are going to be upset and <laughs> I'm a little upset as well. Really not one for that game. So it's going to be called Storm Chasers Premium Warbon. There's going to be two new armor sets, the FN07 Carpenter and the FN X5 Bomber. They both have electrical conduit. So we already have the electrical conduit armor passive in game. It's very useful if your whole team runs it, but if it's only you running it and you're over here shooting a lot of arc weapons, it's pretty shitty because you'll kill a lot of your teammates <laughs> if you don't have good aim. Okay, so there'll be two new weapons, arc 15 ion storm and arc 34 welder. Now I have never seen any of those uh, for leaks, so I'm not sure what those could be. Possibly the FN Scar, since that is one of the most iconic and popular weapons in Fortnite. Okay, so there's gonna be the new title is gonna be called Storm Chaser, and as you can see, there is the Fortnite symbol. So I hope this is not real. <laughs> I think it is. Fuck. So as you can see, the two new screenshots. It looks like it is gonna be a Fortnite crossover. I mean. Hey, all to people that like Fortnite, you know, I'm not one for it. I used to play in season one and two when it first, first came out and I had the knockoff John Wick, but uh, I don't know. I just, it fell off for me personally. I understand a lot of people might love that game still. So there's going to be two, three new patterns as well. So again, they're going to exclude the uh, overpowered primary weapon like they always used to do for each premium warbond. So that's a little sad to me, but I guess since we already have the Blitzer, they're like, well, what could we really do? So, <sighs> yeah, we'll see. But there's going to be three, one for the shuttle, one for the Hellpod, and one for the Exosuit. Uh, so my thoughts on this so far, though, guys, like this was not one of the crossovers I was expecting at all. I understand Fortnite is the biggest game one of the biggest games right now and that is probably one of the best to cross over with just because you'll have you'll get a lot more people to be curious about about hell divers and be like all right well i'm gonna go try and see what that i mean i don't think anybody does that but you never know they probably might use a hell diver outfit on fortnite and then be like oh i gotta go actually try the game so it could be good for the game since right now 90 percent of the player base is gone apparently even though there's around 90,000 people on Steam and PlayStation, but I get it. There was like 600 and some thousand when it first came out, but it's all good. No worries. One of the reasons why I think it will be real is just because these emotes right here and the vigorous thrusting just seems a little out of place for Helldivers, but I think that works perfectly for Fortnite. But yeah, so it's a little strange to me. If you guys haven't seen my crossover videos already, those were kind of like the ideas I had. I would have loved Dead Space, and I get it. Dead Space isn't a really big game to people right now, you know? Like their last remake came out in what, 2021 or 22? I can't remember. And then Resistance Fall of Man is no longer making new IP or making new games, so. Killzone, same thing. They're doing Horizon Zero Dawn. I thought it was going to be more of a PlayStation partner, such as Destiny. It would have made a lot more sense. So it's just a little little weird to me to see this. Hopefully they don't try to go too over the top with the Fortnite crossover. If it is, because I don't want to see everybody running around looking like a fucking clown while we're dropping trying to kill bugs and brutalize shit. You know, it just it's just not the game for it. You know what I mean? This game is all about carnage and killing shit. And Fortnite is a cartoon game. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not trying to shit on the game, but it's just it's a little upsetting if this is true. And if this is just uh if somebody's just trolling right now, it's that's a lot very disappointing to me. But yeah guys, uh, stay tuned for more leaks to come out for this specific warbond. I will be on top of it. 
but yeah, a little, a little weird to me right now. But yeah, okay, so stay safe out there, and peace out.